talk about Carl Andre a little bit, who he is, what he did, why he was important, you know, and then we can have a moment of silence. You know, right? Yeah, say thank you for your for your service to the cultural community. Now we're going to dismantle you and, and continue on this rich tradition. Can you ask them, um, do they know who Carl Andre is? Raise your hand. Carl Andre? He's like gorgeous. Thank you. Oh. What makes a minimalist sculpture? We do. We do. Uh, yeah. 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 Small scale the sculpture like animals, something like that. Not so much. No. <laughs> the minimalists hated animals. Include <laughs> 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 these onions. Yeah. Amazing. Okay. <laughs> no animals. No narratives. No stories. Oh, <laughs> You know, before this, abstract expressionism, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. The gesture, you know, and the genius artist. Mm. And then, so the minimalists were reacting to this, okay? They said, they said, no, no, no. Okay, we need to, we need to deal with the real world. But the idea was to buy something off the shelf, things that were manufactured, not expressive objects that an artist would make. Wood or yeah, plywood, bricks, um, glass, like sheet glass or granite, fire no, bricks. That's not what I said. That before, All right. So what I need you guys to do is I need um, I need each of you to take a brick, okay? And we're going to start laying it out. One brick. Now we go that way. And the reason it has to be neat is that it can't be about funkiness or expression. It has to be about geometry. There's a little that's that's personal expression right there. We can't have any of that. Uh, take a look at it, feel the experience of it. No? And then in about 20 minutes, half an hour, we'll start the oven. Start ah. building the oven. Would you grab the uh, the arch there? Put the gravel up here. Gravel. Little gravel. We don't want to put them in the pizza. Local material. We love it. Okay. Here you go. We're waiting on. I wonder if you're asking it in a relationship to like the kind of traditional sculpture. No, just how do you see, how did you come to make pizza, I guess? Yeah, I start mean, there. right. I think that for me, the, the biggest thing about making art is about having conversations about the world that we live in. I got interested in, in bread making and dough a number of years ago because I was really frustrated by the options available to me. And uh, so I decided, and then I had this great experience with dough in, in Spain. And, Anyway, I, I decided, okay, I'm gonna learn how to, how to do this myself. My practice is I'm really interested in, in the terms by which uh, the built environment uh, is comprised and made and appears. And so for me, what happens with, with this and a lot of other projects is that I'm interested in, in offering other alternatives. So if you don't find something in the world that you like, you know, the, the gesture, I think, as, um, as a human being and as an artist is to make something different, make something new. For me, the thing that I love about bread is that it combines the things that I really love about art, which is uh, community, conversation, and a kind of celebration. Privately, what I love about it is that it's a practice. You know, it's like I've made literally just hundreds and hundreds of pizzas. You know, there's always this return to and return and kind of building off of the knowledge that I have. Um, and that's something that I really love about it. So practice is really important. But mostly it's about, it's about this gesture that is about, you know, what kind of world do you want to live in and make it? And again, it's like, you know, I'm not a baker in the sense of, um, of somebody that's trying to make a living off this. But I'm interested, and I guess that's why, for me, why this, this gesture is, um, although it's pizza, it's also a gesture about art because 
I'm not just interested in the pizza. I'm interested in what the pizza represents in, in a world that is basically make it fast, cheap, disposable, you know, take out dominoes kind of stuff. So that's what, for me, what this is all about.